Good morning, September 1st. Every year, thousands of hunters flock to the farm fields of Oklahoma, where they patiently wait on the migratory birds of North America flying to their southern homes. Chase and I sitting on a wheat field in uh, Afton, Oklahoma. We got a Ottawa County sunrise coming up behind us. Some of them get the most enjoyment just watching their dogs work. This is the fastest way to clean a dove, okay? For others, it's the traditions that's been passed down from generation to generation. Didn't take long. Since we did so well with the dove <laughs> yeah. this morning, what are you having to make? Uh, sir, a piece of sirloin that I throwed in for an emergency, for emergency purposes. A sirloin for emergency purposes has turned into sirloin poppers. Yeah. Instead of. Transitioning from, from dove poppers to bovine poppers. <laughs> Bo bovine. These close friends come together every year on September 1st for the opening day of dove season. They hunt, bring their harvest, prepare the food, and fellowship together for the rest of the afternoon. Paula Dean. Hey, nobody wants to see us hunting, so we gotta show them something that they do want to see. No, you're good. That is actually a dove. We gotta get outside on the fire. Make sure the corner's right. Well, it's supposed to be merry. Well, it does. It tells what they like to do on the food channel. That's what I wanted you in here for, Justin. <laughs> Just in case we didn't have enough poppers. <laughs> Just in case. Yeah. This is quite a contraption here. Those crates lower down. The camaraderie of friends echoes in the man cave as they recall past stories. These stories tell of a simple life that only those who have lived it can relate to. These simple times fall to the wayside of a fast-paced world we live in of cell phones and gaming. That's why it's so important to pass on these traditions to our younger generations so we can preserve this way of life and the conservation of wildlife. In addition to producing food for us and our livestock, croplands also provide a pit stop for the migration of doves. Nowhere else can they stop and recharge for a few days before they head south. So the next time you see a farmer, thank them. As for the Battle Branch Boys, you'll find us somewhere in Northeast Oklahoma on September 1st, waiting on the sun's glory and the whistling wings of the dove to arrive. <laughs>